Let's meet the starters for race one. Number one is Cocktail Peanuts, owned by Bill and Marta Alanya of Seymour, trained and driven by Bill Alanya. Number two, Knowing Vice, is scratched. Number three is Budgate Margaret, owned by Robert J. Budig of Hinsdale, trained by Jim Ferguson with Dale Heitman in the bike. Number four is Always Quick Speed, owned by Grant Walker, by Rick and C.D. Huffman of Sigourney, Iowa, trained and driven by Michael Cox. Number five is Roll of Victory, owned by Harvey Eisman of Flint, Michigan, trained by Irvin Miller. Driver is Andy Miller. Number six, El Bohemian, owned by Patricia Jenks of Winona Lake, Indiana, trained by Amanda Smith, the driver, Sam Widger. Number seven is March for Hope, owned by Larry Barnett, Leroy Moyer, and Ed Rigg of Decatur, trained by Leroy Moyer. Dean McGee is in the bike. Number eight is Castaway K, owned by Roger Welch of Belvedere and Michael Shan of Chicago, trained by Roger Welch. He will drive. And number nine is BP's Love, owned by H. Phil Pierce of Carmi, Buddy Simpson of Fairfield, trained by Buddy Simpson, the driver, Clay Simpson. The track is fast, currently four minutes till post on the first half, the Daily Double. Illinois bred two-year-old trotting fillies an eighth of a mile from the start. Here they come. They're off and trotting. El Bohemian grabs the racetrack, followed by March for Hope, who gets away second. Cocktail Peanuts is third down toward the inside. And then Budgate Margaret comes out trotting in fourth. But El Bohemian sails on toward the quarter-mile mark, getting away on a five-length lead. Widger is going to let her have her head here early, and she opens up by a sizable margin. Cocktail Peanuts goes second, followed by Budgate Margaret racing in the third spot. And then March for Hope, Budgate Margaret is off stride. Always quick speed, moves up a spot in fourth toward the rail, 29 and one for the opening quarter, followed by Castaway K, who's fifth on the outside, then BP's Love, a gap of 15 more lengths to Budgate Margaret, and another dozen to Roll of Victory, who had problems after the start, made a mistake, and now trails the field, racing down the backside. They're being led by two lengths by El Bohemian, Cocktail Peanuts is closing that margin, Castaway K is going a tough trip, parked third up within three lengths of the lead but she's never seen the rail followed by march for hope who is fourth toward the inside the half was timed in 101 and then bp's love moves up on the outer flow and fifth with cover followed by always quick speed on the outside the top six separated by four lengths three in three to the outside onto the far turn el bohemian leads at three parts of a length castaway k tries to draw alongside Cocktail Peanuts locked in toward the rail, then BP's Love on the outside, followed by Always Quick Speed on the outside of March for Hope. Moving by the three quarters, El Bohemian was there in 132 and four. El Bohemian leads Castaway K by a length. Cocktail Peanuts needs room, she's buried third. And then BP's Love and March for Hope. Moving by the eighth pole, El Bohemian tries to take it wire to wire. She's opening up again by five lengths. Cocktail Peanuts is second, then BP's Love in the center of the track third. El Bohemian, much the best in today's opener. El Bohemian cruises on home to win it by 10 lengths. Cocktail Peanuts second, BP's Love was third. The time for the mile, 2.02 flat. Unofficially, number six, El Bohemian is first. The one, Cocktail Peanuts second. The nine, BP's Love third. And the eight, Castaway K fourth. Sam Widger is a native of Peoria, Illinois. Got interested in harness racing when he was involved on construction crews helping build barns at Quad City Downs. Now he's one of America's most well-known drivers, very successful on the Chicago Tour. And he is the winner unofficially in the first race today. Driver Sam Widger of Peoria, El Bohemian. Patricia Jenks of Winona Lake, Indiana, owns this giant triumph two-year-old filly, trained by Amanda Smith, bred by David Jenks in Indiana. 2.02 flat, the time for the mile. 
bred by residents of Indiana, but this filly very much an Illinois bred filly by the Sire Giant Triumph, and the result is official for the first race.